Ladies and gentlemen, it has been a while since I posted a YouTube video. The holidays have been crazy. Work has been crazy. But I'm here to talk about something that I got for Christmas. And it is the Artisan Hein uh, Soft mouse pad. And I never really had like a really good mouse pad, I guess you could say. Like I had $40 ones, like my Razer one that I'm using right here, um, Gigant. The Gigantuan, I think it's called. <clears throat> um, the Razor Gigantuan. Um, I like this mouse pad, but it's not like a really good mouse pad. So I've heard in the aiming community, uh, I like desk pads. Okay, I really do like desk pads. But let's talk about this pad and the gameplay in the background is me using this pad. I had it for about four days ever since Christmas, and uh. Let me tell you, going from my Razer Gigantuan, which is about a $40 mouse pad, over to this Artisan Hein, which is right now, I think is around $70, $80. It felt weird at first. Uh, I don't know. It felt like um, I was rubbing my hand over a, uh, I don't know if you guys have a sky pad, but it, it felt like I was running my hand over a sky pad but it was cloth if that makes sense um this this pad is pretty fast I, i'm not gonna lie it's pretty fast um i don't know if it's just because it's clean or if it's just because um like you guys can see here it, it, it literally just glides um or just a new pad and needs to get broken in i've been i have a probably around 12 hours on this pad so far 12 Ah, I'd say around 24, around 24 hours on this pad. Um, but once I got used to this pad, and it's you're going to have to give it a couple of days, because when I first got this pad, I was like, I don't like it. What the heck's going on? You're going to have to give this pad a couple of days if you decide to get it. And, and I'm going to tell you guys right now, getting a good mouse pad, like a $40 one, going from you know my razor gigantuan to this it doesn't make you like a better aimer like i can aim on both right but this one i prefer and it's probably my favorite mouse pad and i can still break it in more but just how smooth it is how easy it is to track and i have the stopping power it's like the sky pad but i have stopping power with it if that makes sense um this is just my G Pro Super Light. Um, it is really good, I would say, when it comes to aiming. And I, at first, didn't really like this small pad. Because if you guys can see, like, going from a really big desk pad to this tiny little, it's not really that tiny, it's actually kind of big. This tiny little pad. <clears throat> I was scared that I wouldn't have enough room to like do my 360s or anything. But as you guys could see, I'm still on the same sense 3.2 um, with a 1 ADS 1.78 monitor coefficient. And I'm still able to like turn around, shoot people. And I would say my aim is as smooth as it's going to get when it comes to um, playing Call of Duty right now. Uh, it always could be better, but there's just too many random factors that you really just can't outshine AA in this game um, That us mouse and keyboard players have to deal with like the sway and everything You know, there's certain things that just don't pick up when you're using a controller and on mouse and keyboard every little input picks up but if you guys have the money I would definitely recommend this artisan pad I would say that it has helped my aim out quite a bit um, when it comes to that stopping power, that fast pad, stopping power. And again, like I said, I can aim on whatever pad, like I, I've been aiming on this pad for the longest time. Um, but this one, it just makes it really smooth and easy. I would, I got it for Christmas, so it was really fun. I, I'm enjoying aiming on this pad. And I want to see how far I can push my aim with it. It's the Artisan Hein uh, soft pad. And uh, I, like I said, I really do enjoy it. Um, but the video is closing, coming down to an end, guys. I have another aiming tips and tricks video coming out Tuesday. A complete aim routine guide. And uh, hopefully uh, you guys are going to enjoy that.
As always, guys, remember to stay blessed, stay humble, and I'll catch you in another video. Peace.